Okay, so a lot of you are asking, what is this scent share thing that Wendy keeps talking about? <laughs> So I'm going to take you through just kind of a little tour of what ScentShare is, and then um, I will show you in a different training how to use it. So first of all, ScentShare is basically just an app that you use on your, on your desktop, on your computer, um, to schedule, organize, save, um, post. It, it works in Facebook. It works in Twitter. It works in Instagram. Um, and it just makes it so that you can create something once and then you can actually share it with your team and they can use it for their parties. You can create it once and, and do a whole event and then you can duplicate that event. I am all about working smart. <laughs> and so I feel like this is just one of those amazing, um, someone thought of this and it works so well with parties. It's amazing. So some of the features of it are, you know, you can create posts and run your Facebook parties in seconds with batch posts, um, personalize your party posts in one click, help your team grow their sales with content sharing. So a lot of you have said, thank you so much for creating um, content for these first parties. I'm going to show you how I can actually share all of my content with you in literally one click. Um, filter posts by networks and categories. You can attach it to different parties or groups and um, frequent, save frequently used phrases and links with text clips. So it's awesome and it's super affordable. So basically $8.30 for a month, it is worth its weight in gold for that because it will save you so, 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 so much time. So um, I'm going to go ahead and stop this training and start another training on how to use SyncShare. But essentially, you're just going to go ahead and set up an account. And when you log in for the first time or when you start your free trial, it's going to look a little different than it does right now because it is going to ask you if it can attach to your Facebook. So you want to go ahead and let it. It's going to ask if you can allow it to log in because it needs to capture all of your groups, your timeline, and your um, pages so that you will be able to tie your posts right into your Facebook.